वंस अपन अ टाइम अ मैन वेंट टू गौतम बुद्धा ही सेड गौतम बुद्धा व्हाट इज द वर्थ ऑफ ह्यूमन लाइफ गौतम बुद्धा स्माइल्ड एंड सेड नथिंग टू हिम ही जस्ट गेव हिम अ शाइनिंग स्टोन एंड सेड फर्स्ट गो एंड फाइंड द वर्थ ऑफ द स्टोन फर्स्ट गो टू डिफरेंट शॉप्स इन द मार्केट एंड टेल देम दैट यू वांट टू सेल द स्टोन बट रिमेंबर डोंट सेल द स्टोन इन एनी केस द मैन गॉट पजल्ड विद बुद्धाज रिप्लाई but without saying anything to him he took the stone and went directly to the market first he went to a orange seller and asked him about the worth of the stone orange seller took the stone in hand looked at it and replied i will give you a dozen of oranges for the stone the man took that stone back and went to a vegetable vendor and asked him the same question the vendor also took the stone in hand looked at it and said that Take a sack of potatoes and leave this shining stone for me. The man was still not satisfied with all these answers. So he kept going trying different shops. So next he went to a goldsmith and showed him the shining stone. Goldsmith was amazed by the shine of the stone and offered him 1 lakh gold coins. But the boy was still not satisfied with 1 lakh gold coins. Then the goldsmith again told him take 5 lakh gold coins. But the boy told that my master has told me not to sell this. So he again went to a shop Now this time it was a diamond shop. When diamond merchant saw this beautiful and shining stone, he could not believe his eyes. He was mesmerized by the beauty of the stone. The diamond merchant firstly down a red velvet cloth and then placed that stone on it and bowed before it. Then he asked the man, "Where did you find this precious stone?" The merchant said that even after selling the whole world, we cannot estimate the worth of this ruby stone. This is priceless and invaluable. The man got puzzled with the variety of experience he just had with different peoples. So he went directly to Gautam Buddha and he narrated his story and asked him, "Lord, please now tell me what is the worth of human life?" Gautam Buddha smiled and replied, "You see my friend, the orange seller quoted 12 oranges for the stone. Vegetable vendor said one sack of potatoes. Goldsmith valued the stone at 5 lakh gold coins." and finally the diamond merchant said that this stone is invaluable the same is true for human life in fact you are a gem people around you will value you according to their status their knowledge their capacity but do not worry as this world will also identify and find your true value one day if we see in our lives then we will find that often people do not know their own worth and that's why they settle far less than they deserve the value of your life depends on where you place yourself people will understand your value as much as you will value yourself first if you underestimate your worth then you will get less from this world and if you feel you are worthy then you will get more out of this world most of the people just allow anyone to evaluate their worth but people who know their true value will refuse to accept the opinions of others they will refuse to be defined by anyone because they know that their value is set by themselves therefore don't let people put a price on you and you set your own price hasal with artesh subscribe to my youtube channel for more insightful content